Okay, so Sujoy is asking that what is the difference between systolic and diastolic heart failure? So understand that in systolic heart failure, the heart is not able to pump properly and that's why the blood is not pumped outside and there is a back congestion in the lung. While in diastolic heart failure, the heart is not able to relax properly and the blood is not able to fill properly in the lung and there is a back congestion in the lung. In both the condition, there is a shortness of breath. Now the terminology has changed a little bit. Now we call systolic heart failure is heart failure with redu reduced ejection fraction, HFREF. So it, may, it means that the heart uh, contraction or LV is less than 40%. While the other one, diastolic heart failure is known as heart failure with preserved ejection fraction, P. It means the ejection fraction is more than 50 and the heart is not able to relax properly. But there is a mid uh, section in between these two, both the components of systolic as well as diastolic heart failure, which we call as heart failure with mid-range ejection fraction. So the heart ejection fraction is between 41 to 49%. So I hope this clarifies. Do read more about it.